Welcome to another edition of Revealing God. I'm your host, Brother Victor. Today, I want to talk about born again 101. That means understanding what is born again. Because when you ask some people, are you born again? Many of them don't know no, they are born again. Some will say yes, some will say no, without having known the meaning of being born again. It's very important because it also will help you to preach the gospel properly. So, now what is born again? Born again is a process where the human spirit is transformed because of what Jesus Christ did on the cross of Calvary. Jesus Christ died for the sins of mankind, but he also rose again so that he can give them a gift of a new life. And why should you be born again with the next question? Because you cannot assess anything in the spirit in God's kingdom except you are born again. Because God is a spirit, either must worship him, must worship him in spirit and in truth. Because the natural man cannot receive the things of the, of the spirit except they are also having the same spirit like Christ. So God is a spirit. Either must worship him, that must have access to him, must also have a spirit. And that's what happens when you, you know, ask for Jesus to come to your life as your Lord and Savior. Why did they call it born again? It's because you're born of a new spirit, the uh, spirit of Christ. You receive it when you get born again. Because Adam sinned against God and caused mankind to lose that spirit so that they cannot have a relationship with God. So that was, God seems so far for, to people. But when you get born again, you are now a child of God. You have access to God. Now, number three, who should be born again? Anyone that has ever said, Jesus, come in my life, be my Lord and my personal Savior before. It doesn't matter what religion. It just requires you to believe in what Jesus has done, then say it. Number four, how should I get born again? Very easy. Because if you believe in Jesus died and rose again from the dead for your sins, and for the restoration of a new life to you, then you just have to ask him to come inside your life and forgive your sins. So that's it. But Romans 10, 9 says, we believe that Jesus Christ died and rose again, then you confess with your mouth, you will be born again. That is easy and is the beginning of a new journey and a new relationship with Jesus Christ and God ultimately. So if you want to be born again, just say this prayer and believe it. Say, dear Jesus, I believe you died and rose again for me. Forgive my sins. Come to my life. I confess Jesus as my Lord and my personal Savior. Thank you for doing this. Wash me with your precious blood. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Now that you're born again, all you need to do is keep building a relationship with Jesus Christ by spending time reading His Word and praying. Now that you understand what born again is, tell someone also. So I'll see you again. God bless.